You speak, but all I hear are lies! You dishonor yourself, Timothy. If you are the rat, then wear it proud! I would have respect for that, and with respect comes mercy. Greetings, Wayne. Come with me. As a fellow apostle of technology, I thought you might appreciate this. Bane and I were acquiring components for a device I'll need once we get to the Black Site. Device? Yes, an ice explosive for the fire failsafe we anticipate encountering. That isn't the impressive detail. As we ran into interference, I determined I would be more efficient if I made smaller versions and employed them as projectiles. Who were they? Hindrances. As you can see, it's been wildly successful. These people didn't need to die. There are other ways. Maybe you're better suited for the realm of business. The people you kill there are faceless. We live in a twisted world, Bruce. Better to abide than struggle against it in vain. One more time, my friend. Why did an alarm go off when it was your job to ensure it didn't? Bane, come on! I, I slipped up! Dangerous time to make a mistake when you knew I was looking for a mole. You're trying to slow us down! No! Look, I want to get paid just like you! I got mouths to feed! Man, when the police arrived, you were nowhere to be found! I... You know I'm no traitor. I stood up for you, remember? Come on, man. We have to stand together on this. I think Bane's on to something. You're the mole. What the hell, man? You son of a bitch! It appears your time is up. What the hell is going no, on no, here? No, 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 no! <laughs> Merely plugging their leak. God damn it, Bane. You running your own investigation? You gonna get little business cards printed that say Detective Bane now? Why are you complaining? I didn't get a chance to grill the guy. I'm a trained psychiatrist. What are you? A side of beef with a hunch? I'll find the rat, and I'll deal with it. You can't be trusted to run your men anymore. They're mine now. Got Yours? It? <laughs> I freed them from Santa Prisca! You just killed one. I only shot him. <laughs> Who do you think wins that recruitment war? They won't follow you! What do you want, John? Right. The laptop. This seems like the perfect time. You don't know for sure it was him, so now what? They know the cost. I value loyalty above all else. You know who's gonna have a tough time being loyal now? That guy. Just keep her busy. I have to sneak into her office to get it. And uh, it's all yours. Yep. Getting it for my old buddy Bruce. And only you. Promise. Sound like a plan. Up top. Yes, that was a good one. Hey, you two. What's going on with you guys? Harley, what a surprise. You guys get me a black site location or not? The answer had better be yes, Harley. We didn't find the location to the black site yet, but we did uncover the code name for whatever you're after. Project Lotus, ring any bells. And what is Project Lotus? What do you want? Shouldn't you be informing your men they work for me now? You? You can't even keep these two from colluding. Pudding? Are you kidding me? He's loyal to a fault. I'm loyal, Harley. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Which is good for you, because you need help. The Mole, Bane's men, you maybe, possibly, potentially can't handle it. A, a 
alone. <laughs> I'm really the only man for the job. Me and only me. You time out. And you, we need to talk. one of my favorite toys. Helps me make boring things into pretty things. Can you be a smart guy and guess another one of my favorite toys? Come on. You can do it. Well, I'd have to say it's me. <laughs> oh, Wayne. You got flirting down. I'll give you that. But it ain't you. Your mold's already set. No, the lump of clay I'm talking about is John. You two are getting a little too close for comfort. So I'm making a new rule. Hands off. Point is, John's mine, and mine alone. So don't play with my toys, or I'll bash in that pretty face of yours. Alfred, get a suit ready for drop-off. Of course. Was your accomplice successful? Looks like. I'm on my way to meet him now. Alfred, keep the drones on alert. They're online and overhead, sir. Don't let your guard down. He's here. telling me not to do it, and then the bat on the other whispering, Just get it, John. <laughs> or did you have the halo and Harley the horns? You must run across this in your line of work. How do you deal with doing something good when you might be hurting someone you love? Because it certainly didn't feel good. Quite the opposite, in fact. I serve the greater good, John. I can't let my feelings get in the way of that. If someone I care about is on the wrong side, that makes them my enemy. A black and white world. So much easier to parse. I did bring the thing, by the way. Don't you worry. Perseus, I bring you the Gorgon's head. You look pretty happy. Well, I'm happy. I did something for you. Maybe you uh, could do something for me. Like? Teach me. Anything. What about those uh, boomerangs you have? I promise to only use it for, you know, hero things. I'm not sure you've earned that yet. Oh. Yeah, okay. I'll, I'll get there. Just you wait. I'm working with you, Batman. It's just been... Wow. What I meant to say is... Uh, it's, it's been an honor. I know I'm not quite there yet. But I'll be battering worthy soon. You can take that to the bank. This is exciting. A new leaf. To new beginnings. Don't let me find you hiding in the shadows again. Loud and clear. Do you have a cape, guy? Because I was thinking about updating my look. I'm your man on the street. Literally. Hmm. 
Selena. I had nowhere else to go. I guess I was a fool for thinking I'd be safe here. I'm glad you're here. Are you? <laughs> Maybe we should just start from the beginning. What happened? I'm glad you're here, Bruce. Miss Kyle is injured. I've dressed the wound as best I can. I trust you told him about your motorcycle accident? I was just about to. <laughs> Hope you don't mind me tending to her wounds. I couldn't turn her away. Not in her condition. Not at all. Thanks for taking care of her. You've been so good to me, Al. I don't know how I would ever repay you. But of course. I hate to ask, but would you mind giving Bruce and I a second to talk? How can I refuse? I'm worried about him, Bruce. I'm pretty sure he's on the verge of a nervous breakdown. And you don't want to be the one who pushes him over the edge. You're right. He's been off lately. I'm glad you're aware. You're lucky to have each other. Whoa, what are you doing? Relax. I'm just changing out the bandage. Be a doll and hand me a clean piece of gauze. Been through two dressings already. There. Good as new. So, do you want to tell me what really happened? We both know you didn't get this from a motorcycle accident. I was ambushed by your friend Gordon tonight. Thought you knew. You and Gordon are so tight. He must have mentioned he was coming after me. No. I had no idea. No, of course you didn't. The laptop. I know you snatched it from Harley. I want to find that black site. Before they do. The laptop is useless without Riddler's decryptor. Good thing I brought it then. You have the goggles too? Not so fast. What are you offering me in return? You know when it comes to me, nothing is for free. You give me the decryptor and we will crack this code together. I promise. Okay. I'll give it to you. But on one condition. What do you want from me, Selena? I want you to admit that you need my help. I want you to say, Selena, I need you. I can't do this without you. Say it and it's yours. Selena, I need you. And? I can't do this without you. No. You can't. Thanks. It's been a rough night. So, what now? Are we gonna crack Riddler's laptop together, or not? I'm out on a line here. Don't leave me hanging. Uh, come downstairs with me. What's downstairs? You'll see. I 
thought I'd seen it all when I found you hanging with the sewer rats, Bruce. This place. It's really you. Rich men and their toys. Only thing missing is a wet bar. Just don't get too comfortable. I wasn't planning on moving in. It does seem a little lonely. I know how hard it is to let people in. The fact that you've done that, it means a lot to me, Bruce. I didn't give a damn about anyone else until I met you. You're a bad influence on me. You say that like it's a bad thing. It definitely makes life more... complicated. It... Being here, with you... I came back to Gotham for a little redemption, but... I didn't expect to find it next to you. It's nice. The way I feel around you, like... Like I can be better. Do you maybe... Feel the same? I'm gonna kiss you now. That's what I wanted. I've missed this. Hold that thought. Is that what I think it is? What is my stuff doing on display in your cave? Alongside mementos of the psychopaths you've locked up? Not that you're normal by any stretch of the imagination, but... And there I am. Right next to Harvey Dent. This has got to be good. It remind me of you. Is that such a bad thing? Did you... want them back? Hold on to them. They look kinda nice there. Tea for two is served. Alfred, thank you. Detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Retinal scan required. Let's try this again. Access granted. Bruce, whenever you have a moment, I have something to show you. The back computer will scan for viruses and other safeguards before we can have access to the data. I finished up a new feature for your contacts. Lucius nearly completed it before. But, well, I've been fiddling with it to keep myself occupied. Uh, at any rate, your contacts now have the capability to detect heat signatures. Cold, too, because uh, with Mr. Freeze, you never know. Thanks. I'm sure it'll come in handy. I'm impressed you felt close enough to someone to welcome them into the Batcave. 
and I'm curious to know why. What is it about her? Not that I'm judging, mind you. She's important to me. I thought as much. Good for you, Bruce. This is a big step. Ah, it's done. Sounds like the laptop is safe. Useful for many different applications. But especially effective when you need to make that dramatic entrance. I shall be upstairs if you need me. Good luck. Look at all this data. Finally, something we can read. Let's see what he knew. Invoices, schematics, design notes. must have been talking about the location of the black side. His obsession with data left us an incredibly thorough paper trail. Look at these manifests. Bodhi Spa. Strange place for delivery of virus incubators. This must be what Riddler means by hiding in plain sight. Patient 843. 10 milligram injection at 0.01% solution. Patient 844. 10 milligram injection at 0.015% solution. God, what is that? Human test subjects? A biological weapon. This is what Harley wants. Agency. The agency. Don't you work with them? Amanda Waller. She runs the agency. Sounds like you owe her a phone call. Bruce, to what do I owe the pleasure of this call? The agency was working on a virus with human test subjects. Bruce, what on earth? I just saw it with my own eyes. How do you? Is that what Quinn's after? Yes. I found the black site. Hiding in the middle of Gotham at the Bodhi Spa. Okay. Okay. I promise we'll get to the bottom of this. But I need you to trust me. Meet me at Wayne Tower in 15. I'll tell you what I know. Harley was asking if the goggles are ready. I'll go back to the subway, see if I can keep her busy. Thanks, Selena. Benefits of partners. Be safe, Bats. You too. <laughs> Tiffany, what are you doing here? Running late today? I expected you earlier. I needed to talk to you, but... I'm sorry, Bruce. This is for your own protection. Hands behind your back! On the floor, now! On the floor! Now, now!
Bruce Wayne, you're under arrest for armed robbery, murder, and criminal conspiracy to commit a terrorist act. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. Gentlemen, please. You have my full court. <clears throat> Shut your mouth and stay down! Don't hurt him! Uh, thanks for the call, Miss Fox. You've done a good thing today. You lied to me! You need to stand back, or we're gonna have a problem. Bruce, I'm so sorry. I didn't expect them to be so... violent. I just wanted them to get you away from those nut jobs. You go to the police, you set up an ambush, and suddenly you're surprised by it all? I, I don't know what to say. What in the... Director Waller? Uncuff Mr. Wayne right now, or you'll spend the rest of your life as a meter maid. Mr. Wayne is under agency protection, and you know it! What? You've known it for some time. Waller and the agency? They're not always gonna be around to save you, Wayne. One day, you're gonna run out of favors to call in. I'm not a criminal, Gordon. Save Officers, it. please! I... He's involved! He belongs in a cell! This is neither your concern or your purview. Go home, Gordon. You're done here. The hell I will! If I were you, I'd be very careful with my next words. And if I were you, I'd stop interfering with GCPD business. This is my city! Not anymore. You're so far out of line, you can't see the truth. You're dismissed. Excuse me? You tested me. This is what happens. Damn it, Waller! You can't do this! It's well within my power and you know it. Waller! Good riddance. Really, Bruce? You would say that after all I've done for Gotham? You tried to arrest me. And I was right to. But you! You should be ashamed of yourself. Leave, Gordon. Now. Time to go, Jim. We'll make sure Gordon leaves, and be right outside. When you're ready. I apologize for everything. Calling the cops was a bit much. Well, you wanted a chance to talk to me, so here it is. Talk. I just don't understand how you got tied up in all this. The agency? If I had known you were... What are you doing with them? Please, just tell me, Bruce. Look, Tiffany, I'm an undercover operative. What I'm doing, it's dangerous. Thank you for telling me. I see now, though. This is why he's dead. He was involved in whatever you're doing. This work you're doing seems incredibly dangerous, but there's something I don't get. Why you? I mean, no offense, but you're just... Bruce. I'm Batman. You're Batman. The Batman. Come on. I got something to show you. Hey, Bruce. Wanted to show you a preview of your new bat suit. I know you and Alfred are still on your well-deserved retreat, but I couldn't help myself. Dad. I'll upload the specs to your private server. All right. Hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. I'll see you soon. It was hard to believe. But hearing it from him... <sighs> the truth is, there wouldn't be a bad man without your father. <laughs> he made the suit, the Batmobile, the gear, all of it. Bruce. He set the bar pretty high, huh? With Dad gone... 
maybe I can still help. If Batman is interested. It's the least I can do. And I know my dad would be proud. You'll need the proper training. It's a dangerous job. Whatever it takes, I'm in. That's good to hear. Okay, I need to digest. Sorry for everything earlier, but thank you for trusting me with this. I'm only saying we might be pushing him too hard. He's capable and he knows how to cover his tracks. Our only path forward is through Wayne. <clears throat> Let's get to it then. I know you have some questions. A few. Care to explain why the videos I saw said this virus was an agency experiment? Years ago, I was brought in to rectify the agency's past mistakes. Or failing that to cover them up. One mess in particular dealt with black ops experiments. Human subjects. The kind of amoral science that makes your skin crawl. Sanctus. They were a division that was shut down for good, long before either of us joined. But evidently, they went underground. This is our worst case scenario. With Sanctus off the leash, this research poses a global threat. If I'd known where they set up their den, I would have taken them out years ago. If you want them taken out, now's your chance. We know right where they are. It's not that simple. Sanctus was dangerous then. They're certainly worse now. This whole situation, it's given me an idea. I can't put an agent within a thousand yards of that place without them starting a war or blowing up the entire block just to cover their tracks. We know it's tricky, but leading Harley and her gang into Sanctus might allow the two problems to take care of themselves. They have Riddler's info. They have a way in. And you're undercover with them. At least with Sanctus and the Pact at each other's throats, the Agency can act quickly, clean up, and minimize casualties. It's unorthodox. But a strike like this will keep damage from spilling onto Gotham streets. Makes sense. Why endanger anyone else when I have my own personal wrecking crew? My thoughts, exactly. Look, for now, just go and check this place out. Right now, as yourself. You don't want them to know Batman is on their tail. I bet you're the type of guy who has some expensive surveillance equipment. We have your back, Bruce. We'll be right behind you. Keep me in the loop so I know what my team and I might be facing when it goes down. Defenses, security, whatever. Their lives are in your hands, Bruce. As well as the fate of this city. I know you might have reservations about working with Harley and her crew like this. Sometimes you have to use bad people to do good things. I think so. While you were at the office, I did some basic online research on the Bodhi Spa. Excellent. What's the verdict? According to reviews, it truly seems to be a fully functioning business, uh, not just a front. Couldn't tell from the service entrance. They offer rather popular high-end massages and have an active social media feed. It's a 24-hour business, Bruce. There are customers going in and out at all times. idea what's coming for them. It's possible they're in on it. Uh, you may be right, but there's no way to tell until you get in there. Initiate the feed of my contacts to Waller. Let her know I'm here. At once. I need to see what we're up against. Good idea. Remember, you're able to toggle the thermal imaging in your lenses. I'm signing off while you speak with Director Waller. Be careful. Thanks, Al. Waller? On the line, Bruce. I'm here. I'll let you know if I find anything interesting. Caution is key, Bruce. This situation is a spark away from a wildfire. I'll keep that in mind. Huh. Project Lotus. 
This is definitely the place. Bodhi Spa. Good work, Bruce. We weren't exactly being subtle. access door is connected to the spa. There are still traces of heat signatures. Someone was here recently. Maybe guards. That appears to just be a patron. lab must be underground. Saintus has been in the middle of Gotham this entire time. They burrow under your skin and eat you from the inside out. This is why I'm willing to let these criminals be the tip of the spear. Dangerous and expendable. My favorite adjectives. inside the building. It could trigger an alarm system of some kind. If I can hit that before they suspect what I'm really here for. They'll be blind and helpless. Perfect for my people. You just saved a few agents' lives, Bruce. That's some top-notch field work, Bruce. I know being undercover has been tough, but you just need to maintain it a little longer. If you don't get inside with those maniacs, we're going to have a pandemic on our hands. Waller, I need to go. Now why would a billionaire be skulking around in a filthy alley? Carefully inspecting every detail. Almost as if performing reconnaissance. Oh, I have an appointment. Bad shoulder. The main entrance is around the corner. That's not why you're here. My Bane, have you been spying on me? Spying? No. I've only been keeping an eye on you. That's the same thing. I heard the GCPD paid you a visit at your office, so I swung by to see if you might be in need of some aid. Innocent as that. Then, something about the look on your face as you left. So, Determined. Yes, I had a sense you would lead me to something interesting. Project Lotus. This is the secret you and Harley had. Where are we, Bruce? What is this place? And do your best, to be honest. Lies insult us both. This is it. The black site Riddler wanted to hit. So this is what Harley was trying to keep secret. She didn't know. <laughs> Strange that you're here after a run-in with GCPD in an alleyway with the other rats. Finding you in this 
duplicitous position. While we have a mole problem, well, it does not look good for you, my friend. When you wake up, you can tell Harley that you led me right to her conspiracy. Wait. Rice and shine. you're about to face, Wayne. You did the right thing, telling me about the Black Site. But there's still something about you that gives me pause. Something that casts a shadow over your heart. Harley wanted to spearhead the hunt for the mole. This will be her chance. So, be thoughtful with your words in there. They could be your last. She's not going to hurt me, Bane. She trusts me. Mm, trust is a fragile thing. One imperfection, and it's destroyed forever. What is it now, Bane? The rat has been uncovered. Wayne was right under your nose. I tracked Wayne to the location of the Black Site. He had I it. sent Wayne to scout it, so lower your damn voice. It was the final piece of the puzzle, and now we got it. Go get your boys ready. We move on the site ASAP. And don't worry your pretty little head about our rat problem. I got it covered. And Bane, tell Freeze to get one of them popsicle makers ready. You're not going anywhere. You're in here. With me. Thanks for backing me up. Don't mention it. Can't have him stepping on my turf, you know? I said I'd find the rats. And I will. Your father. He was a hard man, right? Someone lied to him. Betrayed him. He ended them. Think he was onto something with that idea? Show no mercy? Take no apologies? That sort of thing? Wanna talk about your old man, Bruce? Kinda strange, considering he's the reason you're standing here. Unless maybe I don't know the real you. You are who I think you are, Bruce. Who do you think I am? A man out to prove to the underworld he's just as bad as his dear departed dad. Or there more to the story I should know. Hidden depths? Secrets you don't want me to see. I also enjoy long walks on the beach. Hmm. <laughs> You're funny. Must have gotten that from your mother's side. You know, my dad could be a funny guy, too. And they all fell down to the deep to drown, to the dark, to drown. He used to sing that to me. My dad. Made me feel safe. Like nothing could hurt me. No, he's just a glimmer in a maggot's belly. Same as we'll all be someday. In fact, you being like my dad, that's why I got such a soft spot for you. Oh, you do? You found me the black site, didn't you? Plus, you're not a bad guy. I mean, you're rotten like the rest of us. But, you actually care for some people. Like that girl John told me about. What's her face? Uh, Brittany? No. Tiffany. You remember? Early 20s, fresh-faced and optimistic. But who 
Who's... who's that? <laughs> oh, that's Rich. <laughs> nice try. Butcher a book. And I read ya. I'm glad you have a friend in this world, Bruce. That's invaluable. Yeah, friends are great. Except when you have to lose them. Laptop's gone. What are you? Yeah, Shaka. We have a turncoat. I've interviewed just about everyone in the place. Except maybe one. What's who? So gosh, that only leaves the two people I haven't cleared. You and Catwoman. Maybe it was the guy who Bane gave the hamburger face. But weirdest thing, the laptop went missing after that. Well, you seem to have made up your mind already. I guess one of us has to be the mole. But you've already cleared me. Trying to make me second-guess myself ain't gonna work, sweetie. Nice try, though. John, get in here! When I told Puddin I narrowed it down to you two, he begged me to let him interrogate you. I gave him some pointers, and now this is his chance. Hi, Bruce. You potential rat. Have at it, John. Harley, uh, uh, do you mind? Can't learn to ride with training wheels on them forever, you know? I'll be right outside. Admit it, you rat scum! You're the... <clears throat> Sorry, I have to make it sound good. Damn it, John. You're gonna regret that. I'm, I'm sorry. You don't have to actually get me. Uh, I, I guess you're right. You're hitting him already. Huh. I'll let it play. <sighs> I never wanted it to come to this. But we both know what has to be done. Catwoman has to take the fall. Think about it, Bruce. Harley's gonna kill that Tiffany girl if it's you. John, you stole the laptop. Well, yeah, but that doesn't make me the mole. Besides, you asked me to help you get it. And maybe you're the mole, and maybe you're not. All I know is I, I can't lose you. Did you even stick up for me? I tried, Bruce. I really did. I said it loud and clear. I internally. No, Harley. She's not a mind reader. I'm sorry. I'm not as strong as you. Well, I'll get through this, Bruce, but I don't see a lot of options that end too great for you. It's either you or her. What do you want to do, Bruce? She knows it was one of you two. She knows. And don't think I don't feel just awful about this since you know i stole it can't help but feel a little bit responsible all right time's up perfect because i'm done you got a confession great job puddin who are we hanging out to dry go ahead bruce tell her what you told me come on go ahead bruce it's okay it was Catwoman. She took your laptop. How do you know? Uh, sh she took a phone call at Riddler's. Bruce overheard her talking about it. I understand, Bruce. I'm disappointed, too. So much for the solidarity of sisterhood. <laughs> and here I was, starting to be a cat person. I knew you had it in you, John. We are gonna do terrible things together. Like, skin a cat. What are you doing? Well, did you think I was just gonna let her go or something? That frickin' chance. She's gonna get turned into one of Freeze's popsicles. I know cats don't like water, but 
How do they feel about ice? She has skills that can help us at the black site. Taking her out hurts all of us. You don't have to do this. I really, really do. Thought you'd see that. We're ready to move. Good. This'll just take a second. Get her inside. <laughs> I've seen that look in your eyes before. On other men, just before they get themselves killed. Come on! Just throw her in one of Riddler's murder boxes. We have a black site to raid. Come on, Bruce. Time to raise some hell. 